So blessing his son, Bell, for 10 million naira. 10 million naira, Bell. Um, my thought, I think 10 million naira is a lot of money to place someone on bail. What did she do? Really? I think the fine or the bail is way too heavy on blessing. But anyways, she needs two charity, two people that will stand that their houses are up to 10 million. I think blessing has money. Let's face the fact. She has her own house. She built a house. And not too long ago, she made a video about spending over three million to do her nyash. According to her, she called it nyashing. So I think blessing is equal to the tax, but the money is a bit too much. And also, she needs two people. This is when she's really going to try the people that will be for her. I know that daddy frees and her bodies, right? So I know if you look around, I can tell like from the social media that she have people who can stand behind her. Daddy frees and blessing are like five and six. And I know that Kemi Olun lawyer is also very close to blessing. This is the time, you know, sometimes we all need situation like this, but not really like bond, right? To test the fate of your friends, to test the fate of the people who believe in you. This is the time. If you love Blessing CEO, go and put your house as a, and become one of our charities. I'm sure she must have gotten some people, you know, everybody does not have to be on social media. We only talk about what we see. You know, a couple of days ago, I made a video. I said, if you are a blogger and if you have to talk about people, make sure, make sure that you are equal to the task. If, even if you are not equal to the task, at this time, it's about who know who, that knows who, that knows who. So this is where connections comes in. So at least if you're going to talk about anybody, make sure you can swallow that when, when it comes. Being a blogger is not easy, right? People sit on the peripheral and they think that being a blogger is easy. For example, do you guys know how many times Linda Ikeji has been sued? And I think that when blessing comes out, this is even going to make her more bigger because she wants that fame, right? But to me, whether we want fame or not, we must also remember the offsprings. Blessings, children are still young and uh, we must remember to shield and protect our children. Our offsprings is very, very important. It's easy to sit down, talk about somebody, but when something comes out, are you really unwilling to fight it? Do you have the tools it takes? Many people can wag their mouth and say anything they want. Hey, madam, why are you uh, talking on blessing? I don't dislike blessing. I like blessing. Regardless of what is going on right now, I still like her. Not a whole lot of people can do what Blessing is doing, right? But, you know, this is the time to really test the faith and the people that you call your friends that stands behind you. So they say that she was supposed to be in there for until May 30th, right? That's 60 days. But if she gets some charities, people that are willing to put a bond of 10 million each to people, she will be released on bail, meaning that she will not be in there until 30th of May. So the news was just released today. So we keep our fingers crossed and hope and pray that the best will uh, come for blessing. You know, sometimes, you know, in every situation, we must count the 
the negatives and the positive. If this is the route Blessing chooses to go in order for her to become more famous, you know what? I don't have a control over that. But I think she's famous already. She's and this is going to be, make her even more famous. Bloggers out there, especially the ones that live in there and are in Africa, be very careful how you make videos, be very careful how you talk to people, especially in Nigeria. Nigeria doesn't have a freedom of right as much as we might want to deceive ourselves to say that Nigeria is democracy. No, it's not. The, if your freedom of movement is not freedom. Freedom of speech is not freedom. So think twice before you utter some words and make some certain videos about some certain individuals. Just so that you will be ready for anything that comes out of that. Blessing. Ble, ble, my ble. Katia is praying for you. Everything's going to be all right. Fame is not... Moi, moi, fame is not for the ill-hearted. Fame is not for everyone. So if you have to pursue fame, anybody that is watching this video, make sure it takes, make sure you're going to swallow what it takes because you know what? What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. At this time, I think that blessing might come out stronger, but she will be very mindful of the kind of videos she talks i have been reading a whole lot of comments and let me tell you every individual have fans have people who stand behind them in anything they do but i think that blessing has gained a whole lot of hatred so many people dislike her i don't know why but at the end of the day everybody does not have to like everybody so but what i'm saying is that when the majority of the negative supersedes the positive, it's kind of, you know, questioning. A lot of people are jubilating and saying, ha, hey, good for her, good for her. You know, for the upcoming ones as well who are looking into being bloggers, just be mindful of the kind of contents you create out there. If you're going to talk about me, make sure you do your research very well. And make sure you can fight me when the time comes. Okay? So before you talk about anybody out there, make sure that the fight is going to be a win-win for you. Don't go half-handed. And then when the time comes, this one I'm talking about right now doesn't have anything to do with blessing. I'm just talking generally about bloggers, about people who come out, and people who have pages and talk about anything that they see out there, make sure you are ready because when it comes, you might not have people that will stand behind you to be your sureties. Guys, I'm going to leave you guys here. Leave your thoughts and your comments. I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you. Love you all.